want to thank uh, Cesar Chavez. In fact, I should have started by saying, Viva Cesar! <laughs> Viva la causa! Viva! <laughs> this is a, um, a remarkable day, and I am just honored to be governor, to be able to actually sign the document. Um, you know, Cesar Chavez is uh, on par with so many unbelievable leaders in our history, and I think has not gotten the recognition that so many leaders in our history have. Studying many of the same techniques that Martin Luther King, Gandhi of nonviolence, uh, breathing the life into civil rights words, becoming the change that you want to see in the world, earning only $5,000 a year at max at any year of his life. In fact, I was sitting there and somebody handed me a card that reflects my favorite passage of the Bible from Matthew, and it says, Lord, when did we see you hungry? Meaning that when Jesus was asked, how people can reflect him. It was the 25th chapter of Matthew, the 37th verse, when the Lord said, whatsoever you do unto the least of these, so also you do unto me. That's what Cesar Chavez's life was about, is the least of these, making sure that everybody has a chance at opportunity. And I hope you see us honor this great man and think to yourselves, what can I do in the world to change the course of history for people? And that's what Cesar Chavez did. So it is. I know this is a meaningful day for so many in this room. I know that its symbolism is overwhelmingly powerful. And um, I can just say that as governor, it's just an honor to even be present when this is happening. And I even get to sign it. What a cool thing that is. Yeah.